This is the second in a series looking at CISO tool in MATLAB 2016. So, there's been a relatively major change in the presentation and functionality of CISO tool in MATLAB 2016. So this resource gives a quick overview of how different compensator designs can be saved and overlaid. So this is a key advantage of the new CISO tool. Something you couldn't do on the older CISO tool was overlay different designs. We're going to assume that viewers have gone through the part one resource so they can open and access key plots in CISO tool. And we're going to give real-time demonstrations at the end of this video. Some assumptions then. We're going to assume a loop structure like this, so G of S represents the process, M of S the compensator. As it happens, CISO tool uses the notation C of S here. The target's given by R, the input's given by U, and the output is given by Y. Overlaying plots then. A common requirement is to compare and contrast different compensators. Now the new CISO tool has got an option to save designs, and that's really key, because you can save designs, you can now overlay them, and each design is given a separate name so you know which is which. A bit of a warning here, don't forget to include C equals 1 as one of your designs, so this option is included in any of the relevant comparisons. That's if it's relevant, sometimes C equals 1 um, will be hopeless. Saving compensators designs then. These are available under the tab store. So if you look here, you'll see that's where the tab is. It says store. So you simply select store, click on it, and when you do that, this is what will happen. You'll see a saved design will appear. Now if you compare that to over here, you'll see there was no saved designs. It was empty. But after I click store, it's taken my design, it's saved it, and it's called it design 1. I can save several designs. So I've got design 1 already and then I go to the compensator editor, I make C equals 2, I go to store and I save design. So there's store button again. And then I could go to the compensator editor, make C equals 3, go to store and save the design. And now you'll see I've got three design saved, all with different names. Now obviously I need to keep checking my own mind what's design 1, what's design 2, what's design 3, but the key thing is Caesar tool has saved them all for me. Next then, how do I overlay the plots corresponding to these designs? This is done through the compare button. So what you have to do, click the compare button and you'll get a window a bit like this and you'll see it says okay what do you want to compare? I've got you know, these possibilities. Current design is clicked by default and then the save designs, design 1, design 2, design 3. So if you want to compare them, put ticks in those boxes and they can be compared. And this is what happens. So when I tick all those boxes, you'll see the step responses have now got four plots in them. Now if you're not sure which is which, you take your mouse, you go over the plot and you right click. And if you right click, you'll see one of the options tells you which colour is matched with which design. We'll show that in the real time demonstration. And we've got four plots because here we have three saved designs, one, two, three, and also the current design, which may not have been saved yet. Similarly, if you look at the Nyquist diagram, you'll see the same thing. You'll see there's four plots, and if you want to know the colour scheme, right click and it will tell you what colour goes with which design. The root loci plot is always based on the current design, not on the safe design. So you need to remember that, and that root loci plot is always using the current design. Overlaying bow then. Now this is the same principle as the others, but you're going to need to generate a separate bow plot from the default one that's provided. Now I'm suggested you put this in the middle window because the bow plot often needs a tall space because there's two diagrams. So you'll see here I've done new plot, I've created new bowed, there it is, and now because I've done that, you see I've got all four bow diagrams linked to my four designs. So, what I'm going to do now is a live demonstration. So here's my CISO tool window, which we opened at the end of the part one video. So I haven't done anything. <coughs> I've got no safe designs. I've got a G of S 
imported and my current compensator is 1. So the first thing I'm going to do is save my compensator choice of 1. So I go here where it says store button and I just click on it and you see now design 1 is saved. Now I want a different choice so let's go edit compensator there it is and I'll make that window just a little bit smaller and so let's try a value of 2 and now I want to save that so I go back here I press store and there you see design 2 is now saved and now I might want an alternative option let's try 0 0.5 okay so we do that and again I can press store and you see there we go design 1 design 2 design 3 all saved but still I can't see them nothing's happening because you remember in order to see them I need to go to this compare button so I'm gonna press compare and you see I select I want to compare design 1 design 2 and design 3 with the current design which is shaded and now you can see I only seem to have three plots because at the moment the current design is the same as design 3 so let's make design the, the current design slightly different so I'm going to go to edit architecture and I'm going to import a compensator from the workspace so let's import klag it's not necessarily a good lag compensator that doesn't really matter it's just an arbitrary set of numbers and now we should see on these plots we should be having four plots so let's have a look systems so you can see blue green cyan and red so there should be four plots showing in these windows now the final thing I'm going to do is add the bowed so let's say I'm going to put the bowed in this middle window because I want the bow to be tall because see there's two diagrams so I'm going to go new plot new bowed and now I want loop transfer function and then plot now I must have done something wrong when I imported the current design it doesn't seem to have shown but it doesn't matter um, you can still see the principle you can see the bow diagram now with all the different designs shows I've got the step responses with the different designs Nyquist with the different designs uh, root loci always based upon the current design So, this video has demonstrated the basic use of Caesar tool in MATLAB 2016 for overlaying different compensator designs. This is useful for compare and contrast tasks as well as design. And the next video will show how to use the tool to actually do design. So here we've shown how you can compare designs. Next, we want to say, okay, how do we go about doing design? And the final video will look at lead and lag.